Hey, so I'm back again with another hair experiment. My hair is slightly damp and we're going to curl it with paper towels. What? Yes, that's a thing apparently. So you need one little strip per hair curl thing. And just kind of like roll it up and that'll be what you're wrapping your hair around. Don't want to make it too tight because then the curls will come out really, really tiny. But just going to wrap some damp hair around a paper towel. I did wet it a little bit extra before doing each curl and tuck in all the ends. And once it gets to the top there, just tie the paper towel together. I had some difficulties tying the paper towel. I was worried it wasn't going to stay. But yeah, so that's a curl. Just going to do my bangs now. And like I said, I was having some difficulty tying the actual paper towel. I think it helps if you make some funny faces though. Yeah. So, what will it turn out like? I don't know. We'll see. So I'm just gonna keep wetting my hair and rolling them around the paper towels all over my head. Uh, this was the first time I really did this so I didn't know what to expect. Didn't really plan out the curl pattern at all, just kinda did whatever. Yeah, I was having some difficulties, so instead I switched to closing them with pin curl uh, clips instead, which actually made taking them out a lot easier as well. So this is the point where I was like, man, this is gonna take a while. Okay, and there's my whole head done. As you can see, the ones I kind of switched from tying to uh, adding in the clips. And then here's a close-up. They are kind of like pin curls. They were easier to do though. A few hours later, I decided to take out my bangs first, see if they had dried. Alright, well, that's not really that much of a curl. Not very impressed. Let's try the next one. Oh hey, that looks more like a curl. And here's one from the top of my head. And what a flop, literally. Um, so that was still wet. Great. So I just kind of rolled that one back up and tried to undo one from the side of my head. which was dry. Yay. Kind of felt around to see if any of the other curls were dry and not that many were. So I took out two and then I decided to stop and just uh, take them out in the morning. Boing, boing, boing. Okay, so we're gonna flash forward to the morning. Just gonna take out the one that derped last night. Oh. And some of these curls are better than others. Of course, all the good ones ended up in the back of my head, not in the front. That's just how it goes, isn't it? Some of them ended up really, really springy. Yeah, look at that one. Boing. Boing. Okay, let's continue taking them out there. And here they are, all unfurled. Very bouncy, and I did miss a few sections at the nape of my neck. But, hey, not bad for a first time. As you can see, my hair <laughs> looks very short because they are so curly. So just finger combing them out to see how that looks. Very poodle hair. Um, okay, let's try this side. After that, I decided to brush them out, maybe go for like a vintage style look. I don't know, I wasn't really feeling the poodle hair. So I'm just brushing the curls in a little sections against my hand to give them that kind of like wave and smooth out the bottom of the curls. You can be pretty aggressive when you're combing it like this. 
So as you can see, it's kind of getting a little bit more of a wave compared to Poodle Hair. Obviously my bangs didn't really hold up as well because I took them out <laughs> before I slept on my hair. And I'm just going to do the other side a little bit. And by a little bit, I probably brushed each side out for like 10 minutes. So here you can see it kind of doing more of a wave. But I mean, I didn't do any specific curl setting pattern because I just wanted to test this out. I could definitely see myself trying it again though now that I've already done it. Um, I would not advise putting the clips in and then trying to sleep in it though. So here I pin the back, I pin the sides back and just kind of messing with it. Oop, there's that one really springy curl again. So yeah, definitely we'll try this again. Now it looks even more poodly when I put the sides back. But yeah. These kind of curls last a long time in my hair. So I'll definitely try this again. So um, I hope you liked this hair experiment. I'm sure I'll be back with some more no heat styles later. And uh, thanks for watching.